Hey guys, Sarah here from Cali Craft Cocktails and I'm gonna make an espresso martini to jack everybody up. Um, now an espresso martini is a crowd favorite in Australia, but you don't really hear about it here in LA or in America. So um, I really wanna get the, um, the knowledge out there. It's super easy to make. It's literally, it's one ounce, one ounce, one ounce, or 30 mils, 30 mils, 30 mils. You're doing 30 mils or one ounce of Kahlua. You're doing 30 mils or one ounce of cold brew. You're doing 30 mils or one ounce of vodka. And it pains me to say, I remember making this like 10 years ago with like Frangelico and like simple syrup, all this shit in it. I think that's what they do. It happened to me in Vegas. I ordered a espresso martini in Vegas and she's like, yeah, we don't have espresso. I'm like, well then you can't make an espresso martini. But she gave it to me anyway and she did her best and tastes like shit. And uh, so don't do it. You don't have espresso, no simple syrup. You don't need it. The Kahlua is sweet enough. Give it a hard shake because the cold brew is, or the espresso is gonna really foam up really nicely. Yeah. Oh, this is gonna be so good. Oh, this is gonna be so good. Look at the color. Oh my God. There's a little taste of Rooney here. You guys are gonna shit your pants. Okay. Here, so what do we need? I need, and I was taught never to go like this, by the way, this is a little lesson. Never go like this. Hmm, where, where's that? You know, never go like that, just go like this. You know, never go with your, don't do anything with your hands while you're looking, because it looks unprofessional. So don't do what I just did, but if, if Noah had have set everything out properly, then we wouldn't be in this mess. So, here we go. So here we go. I've done it in a slightly smaller glass here. Let me, I'm gonna just put it into a different glass for you. Now this glass is comically small, but this is a five ounce glass, so let me just switch it around and see what happens. Here. If you're representing a drink, just always give it another little shake just to freshen it up. Okay. Again, I mean, it's look, look. This is a center for ants. An espresso martini for ants. Ah! Save the day. There you go. And then you can put the rest in your pimp cup. Oh my god, it's like a whole baby. You know what? I'm gonna present both of them. That's so goddamn cute. So that's your espresso martini and its little tiny spawn. So for an espresso martini um, garnish. I like to, for the photos, I like to put a uh, coffee bean on top, but it's not practical for when you drink it, because when you drink it, you're basically just drinking coffee beans. It's like not, it's not the best idea. But for argument's sake, oh my God, so. Cute. Do my hands like this. I already had five of them. Wait. <laughs> Can you guys hear the tire screeching? Good. Perfect. Oh, don't bump it, but that's perfect. We still saved the day. So there's three little beans like that, and then I'm just gonna do one little baby bean like that. That's the cutest thing I've ever seen. <sighs> Dude, that guy just rubbed a bag. Okay, that's your espresso martini. Enjoy.